Our other top story tonight, two state lawmakers want tougher security for Floridians who live in apartments. Mia's Law, named for 19-year-old Mia Marcano. And as our, our uh, reporter Miguel Octavio explains, the bill, if passed, will force landlords to run background checks on all apartment workers. The holidays are coming up. But Mia Marcano will not be home to see family. The holidays uh, were Mia's favorite. It's been nearly two months since Mia was found dead, and time isn't healing family. It's actually getting harder uh, because it's becoming more of a reality that Mia is never coming back home. Marcano family attorney Daryl Washington says Mia's law will ensure what happened to Mia never happens again. Mia's law would require landlords to perform background checks for all employees at apartment complexes. The screening would go as far as checking for criminal history records and sexual offenses. The only person of interest in Mia's death was 27-year-old Armando Caballero. He worked at the complex where she lived. Police say he committed suicide just days after Marcano was reported missing. And a 10 investigates report revealed Caballero was a convicted felon. The bill would also strengthen requirements for access to someone's apartment. There is no reason that any employee of an apartment complex should have unfeathered access uh, to someone's apartment, especially if they have not been properly vetted. It's up to lawmakers to make this bill come to life. Washington says it would mean the world to Mia's family. They never want another family to have to go through what, what they had to go through. And lawmakers plan to introduce Mia's law in the regular session in January.